At what age would you let your kids, Mike, your future kids, to actually leave? What are you doing, Mike? With this, this, this Mike, clot. Stop showing us. It used to affect you. Make you seem like you be. Mike, let me get back to it. At what age would you let your kids leave home? I ask for a reason, but tell me, what age would you let them leave home? Or oh, let's even ask, when did you, you leave home? What can age you, were can you, can you, I don't know. Where, so when you say leave home? So I from not five o'clock this from, morning. From what secondary I mean school, like I was age. I was I was a boarder. So I think okay. from the moment I clocked nine ten, that counts. I was already out that, of that the house counts. because mainly um jet. I mean all the secondary school boarding. So I come home holidays and that counts actually. So maybe more time in school or about half time in school mm -hmm. and at home and then. Same thing university, I, I yeah. So and then from university, I that never counts. came back you to the house. You left them pretty early. I mean, how old did you let I think it was actually the same thing. Really, I went to a boarding uh, secondary school. So <laughs> <laughs> I went to a sec um, boarding secondary school, okay. and then university. I was away from home. Uh -huh. So um, I think board what boarding school helps you um, helps your mind. To be independently, you know, mm. you start um, being independent yeah, you, earlier. Yeah, right? early enough. So, that so that's what happens to me. The, the main crux of this thing now. It is being there is a very local study that says that millennials, which is kind of like our, our mm. age um, group, uh, left home rather late. And that's affected our influence, affected our preference, affected a whole lot of things. <laughs> Gen Zs are leaving home earlier and they're achieving much more than we are. They say the millennials are kind of like laid back. Our parents were like, oh, no, I've, I have money. I'll take care of them. Stay at home till you're 30, 33, maybe even 35. While millennials are leaving home at, what, 18, oh, Well, 16. is there a statistics really to no. back that up? Because, mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. over the years, we, a lot of people, well, in my circle, really, that have left home early was due to childhood trauma. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because I believe that your it's relationship, relationship. Yeah, yeah. Your well, relationship well, with your parents actually determines how long or how early I'm done. I'm you leave home. Home. I'm how, done. how late or how early you leave home. So I, it really still boils down to your relationship with your parents. If you have a good relationship with your parents, you know, they advise you, you take their guidance, and they're very, very instrumental to your career. I, I your think you're projection. buttressing what I'm saying. Okay. I'm not to be insensitive, yeah, but mm. sometimes if relationship do with your parents, food no they ask. You cost it there. So, <laughs> exactly. But you might not have a relationship with parents, but if you're in the house where money day, mm. forget relationship, Baba, stay, <laughs> they stay for us. So that's what we're saying it again, because our parents were comfortable. They were much more comfortable than their parents, so they let us stay in longer. And it would seem that millennials are not as ambitious. We're not as ambitious as Gen Z. Because the opportunities out there now are slim. And but, these guys but, have to get there early, get in, get out, make what you have to make, and then boom. But we were very comfortable. But then, yeah. There's job out there. You get job doing what I say. When you finish, I'll put you it, somewhere. Well, you know Did what? your parents say that to you? It's actually different because, mm. I mean, as a female, you are compelled to stay at home or stay in your parents' house mm -hmm. till you're so married. You get married. Right? So you get married. So your husband, your prospective husband, has to, potential husband, has to come to your parents' house uh -huh. to take you out. Has it worked for everybody? Well, the same as that you'll be mm, staying in your parents yeah. and say, don't be filet, man, don't no, be but then, but then there are also a lot of girls that are also going through pressures from family members to mm. get married. So that's even what even makes some of them say, well, you know what, I'm going out to stay mm. on my own, so mm. to avoid, you know, that sort of pressure. Mm -hmm. So True. that's that as well. So that does the next happen. generation. That does happen. But, you know, these things, yeah, they, they actually function different ways in different customs and calls. I, I know in the U.S., if a man of marginal age stay with his mom, it's not a big deal. No, the, 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 yeah, people, it's not a big deal. Actually people. So it's big, so, so they're, they're, they're like, look, I'm still, I'm still my mom, cultures. and that's because I, I don't want to pay house rent. I don't want to pay mortgage. I'm trying to. Hey, man, you're a sissy. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah. It's not even that. See, and, I, I, there, there are Nigerian cultures where if you are the last kid, you have to remain at home to take care of your parents until they, they're gone. Yeah, but legally, it's, it's, if you're it's 18, you're. Because they don't they, they, that's your call that's your lot that's it your first second third everybody goes but I, yeah. well, if you're the last kid you're staying, you're staying home. at home yeah. yeah certain middle belt and and, and and northern cultures actually you stay at home and take care of your your, oh, wow. your elderly parents uh, yeah but then I'd, if you stay at home to take care of your elderly parents where do you you know find your yourself that's a trap. no that's no a you person. actually that's let me tell you the truth yeah I, yeah in fact now you said it, i just remember one or two of my friends who had to who you, you're right the last one had to stay male or female yeah. It doesn't matter. It's almost like your your life will be on pause. Yeah. Or you 
make sure that your life revolves around, around them. them. Or not around live. them, or yeah, around yeah, where they are. Of course, it would have yeah. to revolve around them. No, but there are sometimes them. it doesn't happen. There are sometimes the person you know, actually just stays at home and you know the takes funny care thing? or is just around you know the funny and thing? being there for the, be there for the parents. I live in Festic. My parents live in Festic as, as well. Yeah. And I love them so much that I actually built my life around, around them. them. So, and I'm the last kid. Mm. So it's not so, my yeah. culture, but I just had that... You know, but yeah, you were able to, to do opportunities were able to have bumbles. There's some people where the parents are maybe in the village or something. Mm -hmm. And then they, I, I know a That's friend a whose one. brother had to stay back. In fact, she had to go back from Ghana time until her dad passed. Mm. She had to go back until the last kid was just there at home. Mm. Wow. But just there at home. And, and I, I found, I, I, there's nothing wrong. I think family is, family is, as some people would say, yeah. can be everything. Yes. But... With Gen Zs, we see more of them. Now, you see Gen Zs who will not probably see their family members till they pass on. They, they because now, those. yes. They're not coming you back. see Jackpot Syndrome. People now move away and you don't even see your, bro your brother have gone to Canada. Yeah. You, you've gone to Australia. Probably might so not So, you might not see other. them it's still that it's until a whenever. It's mind I'm talking about because when you, we had parents who were never home most of the time. Mm -hmm. So, it, you, it's, you, you grow up, you know, taking care of yourself, taking care of your siblings. So, that independent mindset actually makes you want to just, you know,